Beware of pride because you will be returning to the earth and your body will be eaten up by the worms. He should know that his heart is empty of faith when good advice has no avail upon him. When an honorable person obtains knowledge, it humbles him. And when a legislator obtains knowledge, he becomes proud. Cursed is the man who dies, but the evil done by him survives. One of the worst sins is a person taking his sins lightly. It is a matter of shame that in the morning, the birds should be awake earlier than you. If an ignorant person is attracted by the things of the world, that is bad. But if a learned person is thus attracted, it is worse. A man who is shy and modest is an amazing character, but a woman who is shy and modest is beyond amazing. If you expect the blessings of God, be kind to his people. Good actions are a guard against the blows of adversity. The greatest truth is honesty, and the greatest falsehood is dishonesty. He who avoids complaint invites happiness. I have been given the authority over you, and I am not the best of you. If I do well, help me, and if I do wrong, set me right. Speaking less is wisdom. Eating less is healthy. Sleeping less is worship. Socializing less is the recipe for safety. Solitude is better than a society of evil people. God will help him who moves in the way of God. Do not follow vain desires, for verily he who prospers is preserved from lust, greed, and anger. If you want to control other people, first control yourself. In the matter of justice, all should be equal in your eyes. Good conduct is when one does not require reward in exchange for a good deed. Life comes to pass, yet death is very much closer. When knowledge is limited, it leads to folly. When knowledge exceeds a certain limit, it leads to exploitation. There is greatness in the fear of God contentment and faith of God, and honor and humility. Without knowledge, action is useless, and knowledge without action is futile.
taking pains to remove the pains of others is the true essence of generosity. The more knowledge you have, the greater will be your fear of God. The foundation for all a person's troubles is his speech.